Today we got the boldest and baddest lyricist hailing from Brooklyn, Queen B, trendsetter, writer, and let's not forget rap icon. She changed the game for female rappers and showed the world that females can be gangster and sexy. The legend, the one and only Lil' Kim. Coming in hot! Coming in hot! Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, now that's how you arrive. Okay. Can I have my candy? Thank you. You really real. Hi! <laughs> how you doing? I'm good. Want some candy? I'm really on a diet, but for you, I'll take a little candy. Yeah, have some candy. All it right. gives me energy before I go hiking. Oh, you been hiking before? Every day. Mm, okay, we're going to for sure see about that. Okay, let's go, let's go. Got let's some wait. water handy? <laughs> I'm going to get you some water. Okay, come on. All right. You riding with me? Yeah, I'm riding with you. Okay. All right, Kimmy, keep it a buck with me. This your first time hiking? No, I told you, I hike all the time. I hike every day. Okay, where you hike at? Yeah, I thought so. Let's do this Where you hike at? So, you know, like in the back of my house, uh -huh. there's like this trail okay. that leads right to the front of my house. So I kind of do that every day. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Okay. And I do like hills like that. <laughs> okay, so you in the self-care, you know, taking care of yourself. Yes, of course. All right, so what little Kim do to make sure that she's good? Well, I jog five miles a day. Oh. I took a hike every day. I play tennis. Oh, you play tennis? I play bowling. I, well, I go bowling. Okay, you go bowling too? Yeah, I suck. What about the self-care? Like, what do you do when Lil' Kim need a self-care day to just chill and relax? What's Sometimes just chilling and relaxing is the health care. You need that mentally is really good. And, you know, take baths are really, really good for me. I like salts and milks and honey. Moisturize myself and, mm -hmm. you know, just relax and, you know, just kind of do things with my daughter. What about your mental? You know, we know you got to keep your mental strong. Mm -hmm. What do you do to make sure that, you know, you good up here? Crossword puzzles. What the crossword puzzles do for you? I don't know. I just be trying to figure it out. It just seems like it challenges my mind. <laughs> okay. All right, I got you. All right, I have a confession. What, what's the confession? It's Roblox. My daughter loves Roblox. Oh, so you like games on your phone. You know, I'd be walking somewhere and I have my phone in my hand and then I'll hear boop boop. So I know when she's ordering stuff. Uh-huh. You listen guys, this Roblox thing has gotta stop. They're <laughs> killing our credit cards. Oh, I was about to say they need to give you some money. I was about you're... to say, you know what? You wanna team up, call me. <laughs> So, Kieran, how's hiking with Queen Kim been so far? Hiking with Queen Kim has been dope. You know, she got great energy. She has great conversation. I hate her candy, but besides that, it's been amazing. All right, Queen Kim, how has it been hiking at Kenneth Con today? Hiking in Kenneth Con has been amazing. No, I got, all right, I have a confession to make. I never hiked. <laughs> never hiked a day of my life, and I don't, I don't like it. This right here is the second leg, all right? Look, it's gonna be tough, but I think second we can do Second leg? Yeah. Are you talking about going up this hill? Yeah. I missed that, I'm sorry. I would've stopped you at, hello. Come on, <laughs> it's, it's not this bad. It's not that bad, though. Second leg? I'm gonna need a third leg for that. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. Oh, hell no, I am not going up that hill. We get in this car, come on. We gotta go. Um, seriously? Get in the goddamn going car. We got to go. The show is called, All right, let's go. It's called Hiking with Rappers. Okay, well, we done. We hiking with rappers tomorrow. <sighs> I think, wait a minute, we ran out of gas. Maybe we should have been in the stop car. Maybe you need to stop. No, okay. maybe we needed some shade in the car new, so we stopped <laughs> okay. at the right time. Come on, let's get out. And watch that tree branch. It's over there killing people. I mean, you acting like we didn't hike any. Oh, we hiked. We came from the parking lot to the cart. Okay. Well, while we're here, we might as well talk about your looks because I've been meaning to ask you about looks like this. Like, you remember this right here? I sure do. Man, what were you thinking when you put that on? Okay, so here's like my uh, take on it and my view on it is that everyone else was so corporate, mm -hmm. you know? Like, they were like in suits and gowns and stuff. I was like, I'm about to spice up the party. I'm about to come in like, yeah, the queen has arrived. Well, it sounds like you did that a lot because you spiced that up and yeah. this one right here, and, I mean. And let me tell you, those other, those boots right there, just so you know, right? At this time, before my baby, I wore a size 
four and a half, five. Oh, you were a cute size. Yeah, but Donatella, she created, she custom made this outfit for me from head to toe. She was like, no, Kim, you just got to wear the boots. The boots are just amazing. You gotta love them. Cool. So I said, I said, let me see them. I put them on, I was like, I love them. Wow. But they were a size nine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so those was a nine. They were a nine. And you wore a four. I wore a four. You do the math. Then I look at it, they do look kind of big. So what about this right here? This was fun, because what was this? Was this the BT Hip Hop Awards or the, the Source Awards? The Source Awards. Mm -hmm. This was cool because I think Dion and Alexander, who is my hairstylist, she had the idea for this here. It wasn't your typical bang. It wasn't your typical bob. She wanted to do something different, innovative, that would go on for years. Misa wanted to create the cuffs mm -hmm. to go with almost the hair. So if you oh. look, it's like, yeah, it's trying to like, it's trying to like it play all comes off together. of it. Yeah. I like that. So that was amazing. Yes, what about it's the silver hair? That was fun because Diddy, I didn't think he was gonna like my outfit. You know, Diddy, Puffy is like my big brother who just like, He's so protective of me, uh -huh. and he wants to make sure he knows, he sees everything before it goes out. So I was like, oh, I hope he likes this. And I came out, he's like, but his face looked like he was disgusted. Yeah. Like, That's fire. I was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. So I was like so happy. I think everything with you though, people understood. When you came out and you rocked it, it became the trend, you know. They started you have to and understand. still are the trendsetter. Thank you. Yeah. yeah, they started to understand. It was hard at first because people didn't understand, especially, you know, my famous Little Kim squad. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that, that is more than famous. And I was a kid at that time, and I remember looking at it like, I love Lil' Kim. Yeah, and so, you know. I love Lil' Kim. I love Lil' Kim. Yeah, and so, you know, this is the first time I put my candy down. So make sure the squirrels don't get my candy. Okay, I got you, I got you. Put the candy, okay. I never put my candy down. I think we need to get back on this hike. Where are we going? We gotta we go through the whole far. trail. We in a cart anyway. Do you see how big this park is? If you could create a hiking playlist, what songs would be on this playlist? It's so hot, I don't even know if I would wanna listen to music while I'm walking up the hills. But if we were shopping now, my playlist would be, of course, Drake, Wizkid. I could listen to that song all day. Essence is my, that's just like, my theme song to anything. Maybe except hiking though. No, I told you, I hike all the time. I hike every day. <laughs> so if you could do anything with Queen Kim other than hike, what would it be? It would have to be shopping because she's so great at shopping and I'm thinking she might buy me something. Something I won't get myself, you know, maybe a little bag. You know, I'll take a Chanel bag too. So you've been in this game 25 years. I know you got a memorable story for your boy. I mean, I have so many. I told this story before actually at Gabrielle Union's birthday party. When we first met, me and Gabrielle, we did our first movie together, which is She's All That. She was so professional on set and she was just so cool. We was talking and everything. And I, you know, she was so pulled up. And I was like, oh, okay, cool, you know. She was like, I wanna go to the studio with you. And she was chilling. You know, we always have like liquor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah, y'all turned kill up. Me, Gabby. You turned up. She turned no, up. No, she wasn't turned up yet. So it was just there. You know, I went in the booth. By the time I came out, all the liquor was gone. And then, <laughs> and just Gabby was just like, Yeah. So I was like, Y'all was drinking. And I was like, Nope, nope, nope. Just Gabby. Just Gabby. Oh, oh man. <laughs> like, okay, I could talk about artists that are my peers all day. One of the people who are near and dear to me and that what I was just so impressed by and I learned so much from is Charlie Wilson. Oh, okay. Uncle Charlie. Uncle Charlie. He will always be my uncle. He will always be my family. Like, he's my uncle for real. He was so professional, like more than professional. He was like the epitome of what an artist should be. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? And I can understand why he's such a successful man, even at, you know, him being, you know, older and older. And I'm not saying old, but like an older age, you know? Like he has had a long, wonderful career, and he's just an amazing, amazing person. 
I've had moments in my life, especially uh, recently, where I've had encounters, you know, spiritual encounters that I felt have propelled me forward. Mm. And I remember one time you were talking about how when you were writing a Notorious K.I.M., you felt your pen moving. Mm -hmm. So you felt like, you know, Biggie deserved the credit mm -hmm. on that album. Yep. Tell me about like yeah. that spiritual encounter in that moment. I believe that when I was working on those albums that there was someone else there. Mm -hmm. There was there was there was help from God and Jesus. Like I believe that. Like I believe that Biggs, you know, was living on inside of me. I believe he was, you know, directing me and helping me along with God and Jesus. I just you know, for me, he's my king. He's my king in music. He's my king period. So how has hiking with Kiran been today? Hiking with Karen's been fun. He's like, Karan is, he's just the best because um, he motivates me, even though he tries to Look get me I to walk right up here. all these hills. <laughs> Stop playing. <laughs> <laughs> Don't play, you play too much. Is that real? I wouldn't be holding it. <laughs> I wouldn't be holding it. All right, now, this hill, it ain't that bad as the last one. I think we can make it. Oh, hell no. Boy, boy, why? I gotta go. Wait, how did you... What, what was... Now did... I'm sick of you in all these hills. The only hill I respect is Lauren Hill. I gotta go. Okay, I'm not, I'm... man, I'm about to jog up. I'm we'll, not even about we'll to do all that. Then, bye. What? I gotta go. Wait, you, you really Peace. gonna leave me? Hold up. Nope. Jog! Jog with your jogging behind! I'm trying. Oh, this is so nice. The shade, I love it. Complex is crazy as hell, thinking I was really going to hike. <laughs> okay, let's see. Whose house can I see? Who lives out here? Oh, my boy Snoop Dogg. Oh, that's YG's house. What up, cuz? <laughs> Where is this fool? He, I told you, he should get with the new way of doing stuff. Is that, is that him? See, hurry up. Fool, that's why you should have listened to me. Okay. Took you long enough. Get your jogging self in the car. I'm glad about my jog. Okay? Yeah, I bet. Took you long enough. Yeah, well, we finished it. You know, you in a cart, me actually getting some kind of hike in, but you the queen, you could do I, I was hiking. Uh, how? I, this is the new way of hiking. What you mean? Watch everybody start doing it. <laughs> right. Yeah, you know uh, who the trendsetter is? <laughs> it is you. Okay. It is you, and you've had a great career. You got so many more moments coming. You are the queen. What can fans expect that's coming next for Lil' Kim? Well, I just shot a movie with Nick Cannon. Ooh, okay. Yeah. Nick Cannon, people don't even know, like, he's one of my best friends. We've been best friends for years, 20, 19 years, whatever it was. And um, we just shot a movie called uh, Miracle Across 125th Street. Wow. So it's like the, it's like the, the Friday of Christmas movies. Oh, that's dope right yeah, there. So, so it's, we... it's coming out around November, December or something. Okay, so then, Lil' Kim the actor coming up. Yeah, I really did that movie for Nick, okay? Okay, you did that for <laughs> but Nick. But I love doing movies, so you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's something, it's, it's a part of my next level. Nick is convincing me. You know he's my manager. Oh, wow. I did not know that. Wow, your manager has like 20 kids. <laughs> Leave my manager alone. I'm just saying, we, we all know Nick like to spread it around. I think they all on um, Drake's uh, album cover. Now that's messed up. <laughs> <laughs> Look, let's go and get up out of here. Your car's waiting on you. Yeah, so. Uh, but I'm going to drive, though. What? Because you haven't drove in 20 years. Don't you already told me. Don't make me leave you again. I'm going to drive then. Yeah, See, please. You, you know what your problem is? You got to get with the new way of doing stuff. What's that's the new way? The new way of hiking. I just showed you. Okay. All right. Right, well, let's do it. Okay, let's do it. I'm gonna swing this thing. You know, I'm from Houston. All right, we'll swing. swing that thing. Don't swing it too much. Okay, yeah, just for sure. <laughs> don't, please don't call a champ on me. Please, Lord. <laughs> don't do it. Yeah! <laughs>